welcome back to our channel and today it's just gonna be a chit chat video about um, something that we do first of all I would want to say this video is been sponsored by Della Kels Kelis Africa and the person's name is Della like I said earlier on um, she does African wares and she has an online store which is www.kellisafrica.com and she has a store um, on blah 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 is it is 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 me or something something but yeah her website is www.kellisafrica.com anyway let's dive straight into this video um, first of all I want to say thank you to all of you who've been coming to watch our videos and supporting Donary Elegance as a brand um, by the when I finish talking um, I would attach a video at the end of whatever I'm about to say um, Donary Elegance started off as Donary Beauty um, some four years ago and the reason for starting Donary Elegance was because I at that time wanted to start um, a charity organization but then at the end of the day um, I don't want to start a charity where all the time I have to be asking people to donate money or begging people to support me and all of this stuff um, at the end of the day I believe that if I want to give back to society I should first have a means and a way of having to get some stuff or having some resources that I'll be able to give back and so I thought about a way that I could always have money to put into my charity without not always having to go out to beg people to support me and if at all people choose to support me it would be out of their own free will that is me that is so just me and so that is how Donary Elegance came up and so I started Donary Elegance a beauty brand which has been doing well I should say it has been doing well for a small business owner like myself who do not really have all the support that I think I should be having but at the same time I want to say kudos and thank you to every one of you who've been coming back to buy my product who has been supporting me as a brand as a Sierra Leonean as a sister and as a friend at the end of the day you are coming to support me or you always come back because you know whatever product I give to you are products of quality and not quantity we do have products in quantity of course because whatever you pay for is what you get so yeah um, I started off this beauty brand to start a charity organization like i said earlier on and so um i was thinking of going in with mothers and children but at the same time focus on children a lot especially zero to six years old but then i took a step back and look in back into my country Sierra Leone, where i'm from and try to evaluate um, my decision of helping women and children. I know women and children are so much, women give birth every day, um, children are born every day, there are so many children out there who are in need of help and so much stuff, but then I felt there was so much people were doing to help women and children. Every other organization that I've seen are helping women and children. 
so I have a friend we had a discussion and then she went to Sierra Leone um, she had a scanty look around and she came back to me and told me Cherry I think these are the set of people that needs help and I was like oh wow really and she said yes and I'm like okay in this set of people there are still women and there are still children so these set of people are disabled women women with disability and so um, she gave me the message and I tried to do my research so I did a thorough research um, from here in the UK I contacted few people that I know would give me a plain truth about things that are happening back home and in that way I had so many connections and I got to meet so many other people and I finally got to meet somebody who virtually coordinates or head the women in disability or disability people something something yeah and so I spoke to him he is also um, disabled but not as bad um, so we spoke and I told him my intent and then he later on um, forwarded me to somebody as well a lady who I spoke to as well who is also disabled um, she got her disability through the war and she's on wheelchairs but then she's highly educated and so we spoke and I told her my intent and everything and then she said okay we would like to work with you and so that is how I managed to take on women on wheelchairs um, the long and short of it so 2019 we went back to Sierra Leone where we um, first of all before we went to Sierra Leone I and my husband um, put a plan together on what I would want to do so firstly I know disabled women are always in the street begging so um, I said okay because it's a beauty brand I'm gonna start off my first charity with them on teaching them how to do makeup and hairdressing or to just do hair to sew weave which they can do from home and all of this stuff and so I asked Zainab to register um, 60 women so um, she I call them women on wheels because they were the first people I ever had my intentions to help so she registered some of I think all of those women that are within um, the area that she covers and they were not up to 60 so she then asked me if she can go forward and registered register those using crutches and I'm like yeah as long as I have 60 disabled women I'm happy to help so we got the 60 women I started off by buying um, some soap pads um, toothbrushes all the self-care stuff that I took with me for all those women when I was going to Sierra Leone in 2019 this was how I was gonna start a project with them this was how I was gonna gather them together so that um, I can make myself known to them so we went to Sierra Leone I'm sure some of you would have seen this video here on our YouTube we went to Sierra Leone we did this stuff and then that was how I started women on wheels so today I am just here for you to just know how I got about doing my charity work it was something that had been planned but then at the end of the day I wanted to do it properly and we were trying to register um, Donary since we've started the charity work we we're trying to we we're trying to um, register Donary as a charity organization as well so we came up with the name Donary Aid so out of Donary Elegance we've given back to Donary Aid which is the section where what um, that deals with helping these women after uh, my plan was after the one year of training which they've done I was going to go back and give them a starter pack and try to see how much I could encourage people to um, 
take them in in their workplaces especially makeup artists back in Sierra Leone um, people who have saloons so that they can have this woman come in at least just help in way of them getting money than standing out in the street begging with their kids and so my plan was after um, well I'm saying my plan but it's like what I plan with my husband um, we planned to after the one year of training them um, makeup and trying to see what we can do for them um, we are gonna start dealing with their kids they have so much kids like these people have so much kids that some of you some of them can't tell you who their children or child's father is which is very pathetic because some men go visit these women at night, sleep with them, get them pregnant and leave. So I thought after dealing with these women, I'm going to take on board their kids. But we couldn't go to Sierra Leone because of Corona. So everything had been sent back in Sierra Leone to help these women's women start their businesses their starter pack makeup kit everything that i got for them at in sierra leone i was going to do like a graduation ceremony for them this april and then um, continue to do fundraising programs where i was going to come back to see how much i'm going to start a project to help their kids so which no further i do guys um i want to say thank you um a week ago i put a status up on my whatsapp asking people if they can donate just two pounds for me to buy a mask for these women in wheelchairs because of the corona um, virus and it's affecting sierra leone so badly at the moment people gave their monies and these monies were put together and we had so much money that we did not only buy mask we were able to buy some um, um, bags of gari sugar salt maggi oil that we put into packages for these women to for them to just have something so i am very grateful to all of you who gave and donate that money and these people are no other people but my customers my friends um, who gave this money and I'm so so grateful because if not because of you guys I would have not have been able to do this like I said at the moment um, for the whole one year I was in university so I'm not able to make much sales out of the business whatever money that was that I had and um, fundraise has been used to buy their starter kits which are in Sierra Leone already but then um, I went out just to say, okay, if you can donate two pounds, three pounds, four pounds, um, I'll be very grateful so that I will do this for those women. And some of you believe in me, some of you trust me, and I have done exactly what I have said. So watch the video that is coming up next to just see what my team in Sierra Leone did this Sunday when they went out to see these women. Thank you all for watching and I hope you com continue to support Donary Elegant by buying just one product. Buying one product, you helping one woman in wheelchair and their child. So guys, thank you all for watching and see you next time. Have a lovely three minute view of what the ladies did on Sunday. Thank you all.
one for say plenty, plenty. Thank you to so the Eric, with the entire staff, them, in family, in friends, them, the one that always support them. But let these things there will come to we all side at this crucial moment. One for them, and plenty, plenty. Thank you. Because you know, say present day, not easy. And especially we physical, uh, physical, disabled people, them. But let get to live it for the day. It's not easy. But with that, when I sit down, when I look, say yes, we get people there, what they work with, we get the same people there, what they work with. When I say, look to that, when I come, when I say, let me help them put them there. One for them, when I plan to plan to thank you, we tell me sister, we tell me mama, thank you, we are all welcome. Let God continue for protection, let God continue for everything. I can tell you, and talk loud. But the gigabots, because all we start last year, we got the one day, we the time, we got the one day, we not the time. So, so effect, so the structure, even the one that we don't carry on with this class, so we don't reach to the end. The one that we be the goal. You will not be the goal, and no one that feel bad, you don't forget to go. Now, you know Esther Kalon. I mean, I'm the charity of Apple. My name is Apple. I'll be the one for the boss, my thank you for the member we back. One for tell I thank you on behalf of the company and the the people they one for say God bless her, God bless her, and may God bless the family there, God bless the husband. We pray say God continue for remember we, because at this time we they need most. You know they come on and we understand when I would they when they say lockdown, persons with disabilities now they suffer most past the one where they able. And so one for tell I will come up thank you for what you do. We appreciate her. Though it's small, but we appreciate it too much because we didn't need of this thing. We will not get money for buy with the scuffa. We will pick it there. If we not get money for go buy it, but if we get small thing for go there, it's not us. Like I wish we had money, we not go feel that in our way. So we really, really appreciate for what you do. I not get much for sale. Just a blessing. Let God bless her. Let God continue for getting the grace for doing work on this work because it's not easy for help. So we will not to in famu. We really, really appreciate. On behalf of who the woman and her. Apple, one for ten, I will come up with thank you and all that homes there. Maybe they say they go all our faith and they go receive her with joy. So one for ten, thank you once more. We say, May God bless you. Thank you.